We are here in the kitchen and we're cooking up some love with Gourmet Easy. And I just want to tease right off the top, this love edition. This is your meat tenderizer. Have you ever seen a heart-shaped meat tenderizer? Well, we're going to talk about this in just a little bit. This is a must in the kitchen and Gourmet Easy, of course, makes it easy to get this really high quality stainless steel, high shine and uh, polish to it. What a great item here today. It's a limited time offer at just $34.99. Item 210258, that is my heart, well, my heart pick, my host pick is the love edition of that hammer. Now. There's less than 100 in that style. So if you want something kind of really unique in your kitchen, just giving you that love as you're cooking something special, well, do take advantage of that at Gourmet Easy. Well, we are here with Gourmet Easy. Let's start with something that we all use and sometimes struggle with. If you don't have the right tools in the kitchen, you are missing out. Well, this is your Garlic Easy Combo. Have you ever seen the combo before? You are actually getting two different detachable inserts, if you will, for fine co or coarse when you're talking about chopping that garlic. This is great. Now, we have former TSC host and chef extraordinaire, Joey. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. Good Cooking morning, up Maxine. some deliciousness. Thank you. So nice to be with you. So great to be back here. So nice to be here with you as well. And I'm great to, uh, happy to be back with the Gourmet Easy line mm -hmm. of kitchen products. Specifically, as you said, Maxine, our garlic easy press combo kit. Now, why is it a combo? Well, we're giving you something that you don't get with other garlic presses. So you see, it's a three-piece set. We've got your detachable handle. We've got the coarse garlic press. And Which we've is got in the, the shape of what? Yeah, in, in the shape <laughs> of hearts because oh. Gourmet Easy Maxine wants to bring the love back into the kitchen. Look at that. And we also have the fine press here. Okay. And I'll show you that difference in just a second. Oh, great. Because I never really thought about it. If I had just a standard garlic press, mm -hmm. I never thought about the holes in the press. Yeah. But to think that I do want sometimes a little bit coarse, a little bit chunkier, and then sometimes you want it really nice and fine. Because you usually only get one kind of yeah. press. And if you do want the other one, we got to buy a separate one. Mm. We're giving you both. So here, I'll give you the, I'll give you the, the difference between the two. Now, okay. I like chunky garlic in my food. Okay. There's garlic in pretty much everything. So <laughs> this is one of those tools that you're going to use every day. And the beautiful thing I love oh, about this, Maxine, is you don't even need to peel the garlic clove. I'm going to drop it right in. With that, with the skin on it. To, with the skin yeah. right on it. No more garlic fingers. And if you blink, you'll miss. Look at Look that. How easy it was easy. That was, right? No and elbow grease. No elbow <laughs> grease. I didn't put a lot of pressure. And you know what the beautiful thing about this is? The handle comes right off. Off, oh, doubles as a scraper scrape right over here. Now you'll see that I'm dropping some fresh garlic into this little bowl of water here mm -hmm. because I, I know it's not barbecue season right now. We're coming close to it. Oh yeah. Can but I wait. love me a good Korean short rib. So I'm just mm -hmm. doing my Korean short rib recipe here. I got a little bit of water. I'm going to fill it up with some soy sauce, mm -hmm. a little bit of mirin, which is a sweet cooking wine and then the fresh garlic ah. right and I, I like using chunky garlic because I like chewing on that garlic once it's cooked I'm just gonna <laughs> pour that over my Korean just like short ribs that here. look at that that's gonna sit wow there you go. And how long would you need to marinate is. that for? Uh, you can marinate it for a minimum half an hour. Okay. The best results, marinate it for an entire day. Yeah. And this look is what they end up looking like mm -mm -mm. right here. Look at that. Barbecue season is just around the oh, corner. I'm just delicious. starting you off. <laughs> well, and the thing about fresh garlic, it is not even a comparison with garlic powder. Oh. Like, what, you know, if you want to have flavor, you want that fresh garlic. And sometimes you buy that pre-peeled whole garlics, and even that isn't going to have the flavor of, of a fresh pressed garlic. Well, you know, those big jars of pre-chopped garlic that's sitting in fluid, doesn't even <laughs> smell like garlic for that matter. Yeah. Fresh garlic, I guarantee you, gives you the best results because it's fresh food, right? Mm -hmm. Check this out again. Oh, I'm gonna, there's the hearts. If you blink, you'll miss. Look how fast, oh. how easy that came out. Yeah. The hearts, the lovely handle here that just peels or just scrapes off the garlic there. That is what Gourmet Easy is all about. That's why it's called Gourmet Easy. Okay, right? I have to be the judge of this. I have to <laughs> see if it's Maxine certified. Let's take a look if, if my elbow grease can get this. Absolutely. Let's There's take a clove. garlic right okay. in there. Throw in I'm as many cloves hearts. as you want. 
As I, you, you know me, in the kitchen, challenge accepted, yeah, yeah. because I absolutely put multiple cloves. And let's see if I can get this going. Yeah, All right, so I've chosen in. the heart shape. And, well, you know, no pressure, but I'm putting the pressure on. <laughs> let's see. Oh my gosh, it's so really easy. Nice. Yeah, I so put two cloves, so I had to have my two hands, but now I got it closed, and look at that. So you know what the best oh, thing about so that is, Maxine? Oh, that's so great. That is so satisfying. Is that satisfying. your fingers aren't gonna smell like garlic throughout the day? That's right. Because you didn't touch it. <laughs> I didn't touch it. It was completely hands-free. Now, I'm gonna use, I love the fact that it comes off, and then I use this as the scraper. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. I've always used a knife, which is really bad because I'm dulling the knife, dulling the knife as yeah. I'm, I'm scraping all. And then there's really no waste. There's really, like you're Not really whatsoever. getting the whole garlic press and then you smell that, oh. Can I steal some I'm, of this what? garlic from no. my pasta over here? Mm, yes, go ahead, <laughs> thank you. Well, look at that fresh garlic going right into our tomato sauce does pasta Does that make right me here. your sous chef, Joey? It totally does, I'm but I don't have the salary now. to pay for that. <laughs> just so you know. So fresh garlic going right into our tomato sauce pasta here. And uh, as you said, Maxine, how mm -hmm. easy was that for you to yeah. put the cloves in? Um, and, and just give it a quick squeeze, that's all Well, you all know, is. I've gone through a couple of garlic presses at home, and so the fact that it's all made from one piece, it means that it's not gonna break. Yes. This is sturdy, and when you're squeezing it, you don't feel like you're bending it. This is something that makes it easy. Doesn't it feel solid in it your does. hand? It does. Well, that's because it's yeah, made lightweight. of a 304 grade 304. stainless steel. Okay. That is one of the highest quality stainless steels that's food grade. Mm -hmm. that we're using here. And again, look at how ergonomic this is shaped, right? It almost looks like a, like, like a cool sports car. Yeah. Right? Just that wicked curve. That aerodynamic <laughs> curve. But that's also ergonomic as well. You can mm -hmm. grip it in your hand. Yeah. It's really easy to hold. Sometimes you might have dis dexterity issues. Maybe, you know, you don't want to, you don't, well, you don't want to touch the garlic, right? Right. The garlic easy combo press, again, coming with those two different yeah. sizes, fine and coarse, that is what's going to get that garlic into your dishes without your fingers smelling like garlic. It's so impressive. So if you are looking for something that's going to give you fine and coarse all in one, you have to have the combo. In fact, I want to see what the difference is. So I'm going to do one in the fine. the fine. And it's just so easy to, you know, interchange. It doesn't need to lock into place. It just slides into mm -hmm. place. So I have the fine, which is the circles here. And then the other one is the uh, heart shape, the heart which shape, I Which love. is the coarse yeah. as well. I need some garlic in my cream pasta here anyway. Okay. Look at that, look at it that. Really... And look at the difference with the fine. You really mm -hmm. are getting that fine kind of mince. If you wanted to do that with a knife, you'd be on the cutting board for an, an extended oh. period of time trying to get sure. that. Sure, and you'd right? be holding the garlic down. Okay, so I have the fine here. Thank you so much. And then, well, I wanna put the, the coarse in there as well. Sure. A little bit of chunky, a little bit of fine. A little bit of chunky, a little bit of fine. And the beautiful thing about adding fresh garlic to your meals, Maxine, that. is flavor. You're upping the flavor of whatever it is you're cooking. As I said, there's garlic in everything. Mm -hmm. So you're, this is one of those tools that you're going to use every single time wow. you cook a meal. Well, garlic is really healthy for you. It's great for the immune system. It's... It, it adds flavor. There's so be so many benefits of fresh garlic. 100%. Not the powdered garlic. You're making a salad dressing, you put garlic. You're making sauces, there's garlic. This is, oh my, if you could just smell what we have here. <laughs> the control room <laughs> is saying that they can. Uh, it's really, you are bringing your kitchen alive. And it really is as easy as having a high quality garlic press. Absolutely. And not only a garlic press, but this is a combo where you are interchangeably getting the fine and the coarse and the fact that because it's detachable, you are using the handle as that final scraper to get it off. Very easy cleaning because there's no, you know, nooks and crannies. Yeah, you can throw it right hidden. in the dishwasher. That's the beautiful yeah. thing about this is, you know, or for those of you that don't have a dishwasher, so easy to clean because it just pops right off that detachable handle there as well. Look what you've done. Oh, 
any pasta dish, you know, there's just a difference in flavor. If you've ever wondered, how is it that when I go to a restaurant, a, a, you know, a, what seemingly is a simple pasta dish becomes so flavorful? Well, it's the ingredients. It's not the powdered garlic, it's fresh garlic. Mm -hmm. It's the whole cream. Look at this cheese. Okay, we're gonna talk about this peeler in just a second, yeah. Joey. Look at what you're doing with the shaving of the Parmesan. By the way, stop. Stop oh. buying the, the, the sandpaper or the, the sawdust Parmesan cheese. Fresh Parmesan on your pasta mm -hmm. is really where all the flavor is there. Well, and that's exactly the case. And especially <laughs> because you can get a brick of Parmesan, which is going to last a lot longer than that plastic bottle of the powdered, 100%. you know, Look at all the Parmesan. garlic you did. That's... I think, I thought it was, I'm pretty. And Thank it was you. easy. It was easy, so one-handed easy. easy. And the fact that I could get multiple cloves in the same 100%. shot is really great too. That's the beautiful thing about this. You know, easy to use, really fast, really simple. Here again, uh, look how fast that was. I haven't touched the garlic clove at all. Gonna give it a quick scrape on the inside, on the outside. I'm going to have garlic for days. Garlic for days, well, and it smells so good. So you're getting this interchangeable. You see it there, it's dishwasher safe. You take it apart for easy cleaning. You are getting this as a limited time offer of $49.99. It's really a two in one. Well, it's a three in one because the, the handle becomes a scraper. Mm -hmm. Well, we are here with Gore. Gar with gourmet easy, mm -hmm. I'm thinking garlic easy still. Well, take a look at the meat tenderizer. This hammer for the kitchen is really a very important thing to have. And again, it's stylish. It's, you know, nice and, and shiny. And you have an option of the heart shape, that love edition. Oh, you love that? I love that. <laughs> Let's go through it. Talk yeah. about tenderize you know because it's not just for tenderizing no, it's There's called the meat hammer do. but you know it's not just for hammering meat i mean that's obviously the the principal use of this and we'll get to that in just a second but the beautiful thing about this is made from the same 304 grade stainless steel look at it it's a solid piece mm -hmm. of stainless steel right you have the choice of the standard which is the square mm -hmm. and the special love mm -hmm. edition and look you can almost see the reflection yeah. of the studio High that polish. is a testament of that high quality three or four grade stainless steel right here and if you look at the love mm -hmm. the heart is not only on the hammer side but it's also embedded uh, into the handles the and the beautiful mm -hmm. thing also we got a heart on the little hook you here can hang it. we like to think of this as kitchen jewelry because wouldn't you want to display something like this in your kitchen it's good hardware hang it up at yeah. the back here or something like that i love that mm -hmm. okay Let's get to hammering. Let's get to hammering. Well, why do we hammer and tenderize meat? Obviously, because we want to tenderize it, but sometimes we get thick pieces of meat. We don't want to spend too much time at the stove, so thinning it out, but evenly allows this to cook evenly, right? So that's what we're doing right here. Not putting a lot of pressure on it right here. You know what I used to use when I didn't have a meat hammer? What? the oldest frying pan in my cupboard. <laughs> I just found the oldest one and I was like, oh, I need to I need to flatten this down. And I'm sure some of us have done that too. It doesn't, and it doesn't <laughs> really work. I, it was, when I realized I didn't have a meat hammer, I instantly went out to get one because it really does make such a difference. You're doing pork chops, mm -hmm. you can do, you know, chicken, Chicken, veal. steak, veal, yeah, anything that you want to thin out evenly, anything that you want to tenderize, because beef especially, we got that tougher, those tougher uh, cuts mm -hmm. that we might want to tenderize as well. So the, the we'll call these the teeth. The teeth here are gonna help tenderize as you pound it down. Mm -hmm. And if you just needed to uh, to flatten it out, you're gonna use the flat side okay. right here as well. It's got great weight to it and balance. Balance as you well. You know, yeah, it really is. You know, ergonomic, isn't it feel yeah. so ergonomic in your hand? Really easy to hold, not heavy at all, even though it's made of a of a solid piece of 304 grade stainless steel. Same stainless steel that is uh, that is used in high quality kitchen tools, food grade as well. Mm -hmm. Throw the, You can throw this in the dishwasher time and time again, and it's gonna look like the day that you bought it. It's beautiful, it really is. And you're seeing, uh, well, we have all sorts of great tips for you. We're gonna talk about the peeler in a moment, mm -hmm. but the fact that this is stainless steel that's food grade and dishwasher safe really just makes it easy as the name intends. Mm -hmm. But you're going to see, you know, let's show them side by side yeah. for the fact that you do have two options when you're shopping the hammer here. So the Love Edition 
is that heart shape. Look at even just the handles. And the fact that so it's pretty, all man. one piece means that it's not gonna break, right? Not at all. You're never gonna have the handle fly or the head fly off the handle. But then you can see the differences in the textures of the handle. Yes. You have the square one with a square pattern or diamond pattern, and then you have the heart pattern. And even the hook is gonna be different in these two options. So your choice, the square, which is the standard, or oh, the that love. love edition. I think this is gonna be a talking point. If you ever have, uh, you know, someone in the kitchen with you, they're gonna be like, wow, yeah. wow, you have a heart-shaped meat hammer. It's absolutely fantastic. Well, this is item 210258, and there's other things you can do with the hammer. You can, you know, get the aromatics out of, you know, Fresh yeah, like pepper. Crush, uh, crush some peppercorns. You can crush Walnuts. your nuts for your yeah for your uh, uh, banana breads and stuff like that. Mm. You can use the, the the hammer for really anything that you need to do that really hard work. Okay. Just don't use the frying pan anymore. <laughs> you can keep the frying pan <laughs> in the drawer. Uh, okay, let's go to the peeler now. Yeah. We actually have two styles for this peeler, and that's just personal preference. They're yeah. both ergonomic. Absolutely. But look the, at the styles. So the beautiful thing about this is, Maxine, again, made of the same 304 grade stainless steel, very ergonomic to hold in mm -hmm. the hand. We have this one, which is, we're calling the I peeler, because of course it's straight like line, the eye. Yeah. And then we have the Y peeler right here for obvious reasons. The same stainless steel uh, tilting blade is on here as mm -hmm. well. And as you said, just really personal preference, mm -hmm. right? If you like pulling, towards you to peel or pushing away Look at the glide peel. of that, and look, Joey. Look how paper oh thin my that gosh. Is. Look at well, that. And we were chatting about that because, <laughs> you know, a cucumber skin is is very thin. Yes. I don't want to lose half my cucumber. Exactly. Or, and the zucchini as we're seeing and here. We all know how much produce costs these days. Yeah. We don't want to be peeling all of the meat off of here. Yeah. But look, just paper thin, oh. the best chef mm -hmm. wouldn't be able to do this consistently mm. with a knife, mm -hmm. and you're able to do it with the peeler here. Here, I'll use the Y peeler now. Again, it is just personal preference if you mm -hmm. like pulling it. This is great for those of you with dexterity issues that don't want to put a lot of pressure into it. I'm just giving this a light touch, and I'm letting the blade do all of the work here. It's, you're like a barber to... right now with a single blade. Yeah. And it's, it's an art form, but what Look you are thin. Getting is an effortless because what's the most dangerous thing in the kitchen is a dull, is knife. A dull knife. Absolutely. And I have absolutely injured myself peeling potatoes. Oh, geez. Yeah. <laughs> so. Well, you won't with this, that's for sure. Here, let's grab something else. Okay. Let's grab some fruit because, you know, it's cocktail season. I mean, anytime is cocktail yeah. season, really. But you know, the uh, using it on a great piece wow. of lemon here, or some any kind of yeah. citrus, making a thin piece of lemon zest mm -hmm. just to put onto your little, little cocktail twist. over here. Yeah. yeah, a little twist of lemon. Okay, I want to try the Y because I've always Please been do. an I, and so let's see. And I actually have a, a tool sim similar to this. So mm -hmm. may I may I peel a Absolutely. pear? Absolutely. All right. Absolutely. So for the straight for the Y one. You know, it really is, I guess, a personal preference, mm -hmm. but this is, it's so easy. Yeah, the blade is so sharp, it's doing most of the work oh. there. And you know, the, the the beautiful thing I love about that tilting blade is because, you know, mm -hmm. every piece of produce, they're all different sizes and shapes, and some got bumps, some are not, right? This is one of, more, one of the more perfect uh, pieces here that we chose. But, you know, realistically, produce isn't like that. But that blade is that. gonna get around those curves, yeah. still give you that paper, Thin it really peel. is just the peel. Mm -hmm. There's, you're not losing any of the mass on this potato. I've got the uh, the eye peeler here on this apple, mm -hmm. not the best apple, but that's okay. <laughs> and see, the beautiful thing here is, is not, we're not just peeling things to, to take off. You can actually peel to create mm. as well, because we've got this beautiful peel salad, right, of just some thinly sliced cucumbers, some thinly sliced carrots, and that's all because of the peeler. Wow. Right? Did you really peel these these snap peas? Yeah, absolutely. Wow. 
You're, uh, oh, you're fancy. we fancy up in here <laughs> in this morning at TSC. But th that's the beautiful thing mm -hmm. about this is you couldn't do that with the knife even as the best chef. You wouldn't want to do this kind <laughs> of work so right, as the best chef. Yeah. Right? It's all about having the right tools. Doctors, they use the right tools. Dentists, okay. they use the right tools. The same thing goes in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. When you have the right tools, you're going to be able to do everything you set out to do because oh. it's going to be effortless. It's not going to feel like work. Right. This is fabulous. I mean, if you're talking about easy, it has to be gourmet easy. We have the Y peeler or the I peeler. So this is the opportunity for you to pick your style, but it's the quality that you're getting. Item 210261. This is a limited time offer talking about great deals that we have here. Well, let's remind you about the hammer. We have the meat hammer. It's tenderizer. You can also, you know, for nuts, for, for peppercorns, for fresh herbs and spices, you have the meat hammer. There's two different styles to choose from, so pick the love. Pick the love edition. It's a heart shape for your tenderizer. It just gives the love back into your kitchen. That's item 210258. And then let's come back to the garlic press because mm -hmm. the beauty of this garlic press is the fact that you are interchanging a heart shape, which is gonna give you a more coarse press. Yes. And then you have a circles, which is going to be more of a fine press. Fine and press. what you just did there, Joey, is took the handle off and used it to scrape all those bits out. That's, and that's the beautiful thing about this particular set. Yeah. You, know, you don't get this combination with any yeah. garlic press that you go oh, out there because awesome. they're usually sold as singles, right? Mm -hmm. uh, Gourmet Easy is giving you the option because we all love options. There's garlic in everything. Sometimes we want it different sizes. I like my garlic chunky, especially in a fresh tzatziki. You know how much oh. a little cup of side tzatziki mm. costs at a restaurant nowadays? It's like four dollars. It's like four bucks <laughs> for three ounces. Oh my goodness. Make some fresh tzatziki at okay. home. It's very, very simple ingredients. I got some yo Greek yogurt here. Mm -hmm. I've got that fresh chunky mm. garlic mm -hmm. that I just pressed on the gourmet easy press right here. We'll just scoop it in there. Okay. A little bit of mint. Mm. And there we go. Fresh tzatziki there. Beautiful, beautiful, silky smooth, fresh, chunky garlic, going to give you that pungency. Mm -hmm. And again, if you don't like the chunky garlic, but you still want a little bit of it in your food, you can use you the, the fine. fine press right here. So I'll show you the difference between the two. Do I have a clean one over here? Here we go. <laughs> so there's the difference between the two, right? We've got heart the shapes. coarse, the heart shapes, because Gourmet Easy is bringing the love mm -hmm. back into the kitchen. And then the fine right here. And again, it's a three-piece set. This yeah. handle can interchange on either of these, and it doubles as a scraper. I love that. So that when you press the garlic, here, I'll do another and one for so you. And it's so easy to get the, the handle into each of the attachments. Absolutely. It yeah, just, it just, you know, it just right slides here. right in. There you go. We'll wait for that. Here. Very intuitive, right? yeah. Just pops in right there. And if you blink, you'll miss oh, it how easy that. that was, right? It's the, it's, it's the satisfaction of having such a sturdy handle. It's not bending. You're not, you know, putting yeah. your whole weight into it. It's the ergonomics of the hinge that just pr presses that garlic so effortlessly. And can we just call it out? Our other mm. garlic presses don't look this good. No. They don't look like this. They don't look so, can I use the word sexy? <laughs> this is a sexy garlic press right here, okay. right? Okay. Well, and so I just want to call out that the attachments themselves are more of a brushed stainless steel. Yes. And then the handle is, is the polish. a polish. So yeah. you're absolutely right. It's got some finesse in the kitchen where you are getting a little bit of both. So you have the high polish in the handle. It slides right in to one of two attachments. I have here the fine, mm -hmm. which is the round. And then you can also interchange that with the coarse. Course. which is the heart shape. We're bringing the love course back into up the, cooking, right? the garlic. Well, speaking of heart shapes, we've, we've seen a few. We have it here in the garlic press. And take a look at this meat hammer here. If you are looking for the love edition of a meat hammer, we do have the standard. It is a square and it, you know, really solid, 
quality piece, but we also have that love addition. I guarantee mm. you bring this into your kitchen, it's gonna change some things. Item 210258, and we also have the Gourmet Easy Peelers. It's your choice. This here is your Y shaped, which is, you know, ergonomic, really smooth, very sharp blade, and this is the I peeler, so a straight line, so slightly different in how you like to peel, but I think it's just a personal preference. A personal preference. Per per personal preference, but it's how thin you can get that peel effortlessly every time, and it's the speed. You know, if Definitely. you have to peel 10, 15, 20 potatoes for, you know, kitchen, uh, you know, gourmet meal, you want to do it as quickly as possible, but safely. Absolutely. Well, talking about the garlic press, you are making just fresh meal after meal with garlic. fresh garlic. Fresh garlic on our Hawaiian mm. garlic loaf right here. And okay. the beautiful thing about all of these products, really, Maxine, that we actually forgot to call out, I forgot to call it out, <laughs> was that it's a five-year warranty oh. on all of these products right here. Gourmet Easy wants to stand behind their products right here. And again, everything made from the same 304 grade, high mm. quality, food grade stainless steel. Well, there it is. Limited time offer, $49.99, and you're getting the combo. It's the fine, it's the coarse, it's the removable handle. Joey, thank you thank for you. making our kitchen smell so good and bringing the love thank with you. Easy, Gourmet Easy. It's been a pleasure. Well, we have more coming up. Shop all of this at tsc.ca.